Good morning, you listen to FloorDaily.net, and I'm Kemp Har. I'm at the Carpet One Winter Show in Orlando at the Peabody, and I'm here with Kathy Buchanan, who's with Independent Carpet One Floor and Home in Westland, Michigan. Kathy, how are you doing? I'm doing great, Kemp. How are you? I'm great. Thanks for being with me here. You're the operations manager at the Carpet One store that's, I guess, halfway between Detroit and Ann Arbor, right? That's correct. Right smack in the middle. Yeah. And how are business conditions up there now? Well, you know, we had a magnificent June through, I'm going to say, October. And then I don't know if it was the elections. Everybody says, oh, everybody likes to put the blame on something. So I'm going to say that it was the elections. Here we are, a Democratic state in Michigan. And Mitt Romney was, um, you know, in the, the running for president. So it was kind of a toss. We didn't know which direction we were going to go. And um, then November came. We, we have our um, reelected president. And then business just kind of stopped mid-November, a little bit earlier than we're used to. So we just had to make some adjustments, but uh, I think 2013 will swing back around. Don't they say that once the tree goes up, people quit buying flooring? That's true. Yeah, but see, typically people don't put their Christmas tree up till mid-December. So typically business is good till about the 10th or 11th of December. Once the tree's up, you're right. But that doesn't totally stop commercial business. And I think that's our stronghold right now is we don't just soak ourselves in residential work. We are multitaskers, so building is starting to regenerate in Michigan, so we're developing ourselves back into that arena. Our commercial, whether it be Main Street commercial or high-end commercial, we've been putting a lot of focus on that because if one goes down, the other two have to carry the the weight. Mm -hmm. So uh, it's kind of balanced. It's it's doing okay. Christmas, we know that it's going to slow down a little bit, and we just look forward to a little bit more fruitful January and February. So you feel good about the outlook for 2013? Well, you you have to think positive, right? right. So I should have mentioned, but you were former advisory council member for Carpet One. Now you are what they call a ring coordinator, which stands for regional network group. And so you're pretty active with Carpet One, aren't you? It is my livelihood. It keeps our business thriving. It is who we are, and I like to stay involved because not only does it help our store, it helps other stores, and that's what Carpet One's all about. It's a co-op, so people are learning from each other, taking from each other, grasping different ideas, and then forcing them into their business. And if I can help in any way, that's it's a passion. I am also a Facebook friend of yours. I can see that you are very passionate about your business. Let me ask you, we've been here for this first day, and so you've seen some of the new introductions. What do you think is going to be a winner out of what you've seen today? Well, I'll tell you, starting last year when we had our Lee's promotion, our exclusive line of Lee's, it boosted our sales up 68%. So to know that we have a new generated Triexta slash Smart Strand product with a new brand that is going to be solely ours, it's exciting. We have this product that is going to be taking over two displays that have become totally idle. And um, that takes up real estate. Even though my showroom is very large, it takes up real estate. So I'm excited about it. I like the name. I'm really excited about my new Tigressa products because we are a Tigressa store. Um, we sell nylon like it's like no, no tomorrow. So I'm excited. I'm looking forward to actually taking a peek a little bit more at some of the Tigressa line. I went immediately to my new uh, Smart Strand products. So. So what you're talking about is they've just today launched that they're going to have the Smart Strand Silk in a private label they call Inovia, and they also are updating the nylon Tigressa line and calling it... Tigressa Cherish. Cherish is the word. (laughs) It it, uh, touches the female buyer. I think even the name Inovia touches the female buyer, and I think that's very important when it comes residentially. So Great names. I'm excited. All right, so that's on the soft carpet side. Do you sell a lot of soft carpet in Michigan? We do. A little bit of a concern with the soft yarn system with vacuums and things like that, but we have that covered. When our customers make a purchase, we have a closing folder, and we're actually letting them know what types of vacuums that they need to buy in order for their warranties to stay in very good condition for the life of the product or whatever that warranty may be. People want soft, but they also want performance. So you have to have a really good sales staff and a real good story. And Carpet One always does really good with their stories of their products to uh, secure the confidence in the buyer. On the hard surface side, did anything stand out? Well, I haven't looked at my Invincible LVTs yet, but they're going like gangbusters. I don't know if it's like that in every Carpet One store, but where we are, we're using it 
and in applications of both residential and commercial. Absolutely stunning visuals, great performance. My installers are loving installing it. The consumer is very, very pleased with the performance. The warranty is unbeatable. So um, we have 18 new planks and I think 22 new tile collections or vice versa. So yes, more to sell. Mm -hmm. And that comes from IVC, right? (laughs) Yes, it does. And they're magnificent. Wonderful supplier. And actually those products are out of that brand new LVT plant in Belgium, right? Yes. And then I don't know if you've ever been able to go down to the plant in Dalton, but it's a magnificent building. So when you're able to see how much space is allocated to make their sheet vinyl products and how they do it so meticulously with such great perfection and pride in their product, you know that that's going to come with their LVT. So no hesitation on selling that product in our store. Kathy, last time I did an interview with you, we talked about Carpet One's healthy living installation program. Give us an update on how you're doing with that. Well, it singles us out amongst any other competitor out there because it proves to the consumer that if they want to have the best, most perfectionist type of an installation, Carpet One provides that. And if you're not familiar, if I need to reiterate what healthy living is, is we will take up the existing carpet from their home and padding and haul it away. We will vacuum with a HEPA vacuum, which picks up about 80 to 90 percent of the dust and molecules that find themselves down you know, on the carpet. We will then spray um, a very fine mist of the health neck sprays, which diminishes any of additional particles from becoming airborne. We install our Healthy Living Pad, which provides a lifetime warranty of their home. It's an antimicrobial pad. Install their beautiful new carpet. Do a final vacuum. Nobody does that. It singles us out, truly, and uh, the consumers are wowed. I get to call every client after a job is installed, and they're amazed. They've never experienced an installation, and they've never experienced the sales techniques like they have in our store. So it just makes us special. It takes price right out of the equation, doesn't it? Price? What's price? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, selling on price, like the $39 Home Who Depot. Who does that? <laughs> Crazy people don't yeah. do that. Yeah. No, price is not an, an issue. We take, we take pride in our product, and we want our consumers to have pride in their home, and we want their home to be healthy. So we provide them with the best products, the best service, and longevity for their home. We care about them. We don't just want to sell them something. We care about them. We want them to stay loyal to us. Okay. Now, this meeting lasts for a couple of more days. I'm sure you've seen the agenda. What are you looking forward to in the next couple of days? Do you really want to know? Howie Mandel. <laughs> He is our final guest speaker Wednesday evening, and I'm just, like, thrilled. (laughs) I know it has nothing to do with product, but, you know, it's something to look forward to. You work all year long. You come to convention to find out what you're going to work for the following year and to end a spectacular day with your friends and a spectacular week of learning and seeing new products. It's great to have such a great closing gala. So okay, You asked. I told you. All right. <laughs> Kathy, well, it's good to spend time with you. Thanks for talking to our audience. Again, we've been talking to Kathy Buchanan, who is the operations manager at Independent Carpet One Floor and Home in Westland, Michigan, and you've been listening to Kemp Har and FloorDaily.net.